Hey, what's up everyone? So today I wanted to talk to you about my first major film photography purchase and I have a ton of cameras now but I haven't always had a lot of film photography cameras and growing up basically all I ever used were disposable cameras and I didn't think that getting good photos was even possible uh, with a film camera just because of all of the horror stories that I had heard from when I was little about getting blurry photos and red eye and all that but I found the Lomography website through I'm sure some very clever Lomography advertising because they're pretty good with the advertising and I really fell in love with the Lomo LCA Plus. So my first major film photography purchase was the Lomo LCA Plus from Lomography's store. And if you've ever ordered from Lomography you know that they charge an arm and a leg for everything. They're really expensive. Um, so I, I actually got this as like a Christmas gift. It was around $300 which is absurd and they had it on sale I think they were doing like a huge 40-ish uh, percent off type thing and if you check, keep check on their website you can get some okay deals so I got it for around two something um, but it's been one of my favorite cameras ever since I do still think I overpaid for it because you can get the ones that don't have the Lomography branding on eBay fairly cheap uh, usually well under $100 um, but they of course have the cool packaging and you got like a book with it and everything but that's probably my first major film photography purchase and then I bought a Canon AE-1 off of eBay and it didn't work horrible first experience buying a camera off of eBay but it happens and uh, most of my experiences since then have been great but for those of you wondering this this was sort of the camera that started it all this not this channel but that started me into film photography, really getting into, um, I, I guess, the more manual aspects of it where you have to do zone focusing, things like that, because with this camera, you do have to basically judge it uh, using your own vision, kind of judge how far something is away from the lens so that you can get the photo to be clear and crisp. And I have had a little bit of trouble learning that, but, but once once you get into it, I think it's a little bit easier, and right now, I'm getting some pretty good results with my Lomo LCA, but that was the first major film photography purchase that I made, um, and that was through Lomography. Again, if you're looking for one of these, I highly recommend checking out eBay for the unbranded ones, because they're a lot cheaper. But what was your first film camera, and if you haven't purchased one, what do you want your first film camera to be?